I have to tell you, I'm not sure what to do next. I tried doing what's good. Now I have to do what's right. So, Georgia, let's start with you. You actually worked with John Singleton. Uh, can you tell us what you know about him or what this means to you? Oh, uh, you know, um, John Singleton, you know, it, it comes from, you know, you come from a bad neighborhood. You become this incredible filmmaker who wants to keep it real. And then you find peace in the ocean. You know, John had, had bought a boat and loved spending time in the ocean. And uh, it'll be a, a loss that uh, we will feel for a long, long time. Just an amazing guy. Great, dry sense of humor. We direct, I did six episodes of Real Husbands of Hollywood, and John was an actor as well as playing a director. And uh, he was, uh, he, he will be missed. And I, I, love, I love John Singleton. I love him uh, forever. Yeah, thank you. I just yeah. wanted to ask about that since it's so current. Yeah. Um, but let's chat about the movie yeah, El Chicano because this has a lot of meaning to all communities for sure. Some are calling it Batman in the Barrio. Do you think that accurately <laughs> describes it? I mean, you know, speaking of John Singleton, I was thinking about Boys in the Hood, and I think there's a lot of like, I just think of uh, Ben Hernandez Bray, our director, and I think there's a, he, I think there's a, there's a lot of derivative, uh, you know, from from that movie. I think there's a lot of inspiration. So yeah, I mean, I think that's that's a that's a great way to kind of frame it. I mean, it's it's, it's East LA. It's like I think it's a it's a it's East LA. Like, I think like we've never seen it before. You know, way, you, know. It, it, you know, Shaft was like a, a neighborhood vigilante mm -hmm. as well. You know. Mm -hmm. So yeah. there's a there's a there's a nod to even the death wishes with uh, Charles Bronson, great movies that listen the Avengers fly and they breathe underwater and they can read your mind, uh, great. But a neighborhood vigilante who's been passed uh, from one person to another person for generations, and that's one of the twists in the movie that you'll see that mm -hmm. you know it's been somebody that has carried the mantle and passed the mantle to other people in the neighborhood so that they could make sure that their neighborhood stayed safe. And this film features an all Latin cast. Can you guys tell me how important is this to the Latino community? Uh, you know, yeah, like you said, we, it is a Latino cast. We have Kate del Castillo, we have George and Amy Garcia. We have all these wonderful uh, actors in, in this. And it was uh, for me the first time I got to be on a set where it, it was this kind of uh, this this amalgamation of talent that we you know in in, in one space. So it, it's I hope hopefully it sets a precedent. Hopefully we see more of this kind of thing because I think we need it. I think it's time for it. Absolutely. You know? Yeah. We're in LA. We love Chicago. We both love Chicago. I, yeah. I love Chicago. One of the best comments, I was in a bar and uh, early in my career and this guy sitting at the bar, he goes, you're a comedian, aren't you? I go, yeah, I am. He goes, you know what, you're not bad. Because you're not good, but you're not bad. <laughs> That's a, that's a Chicago. That's Chicago. That's a Chicago compliment. I was gonna say that sounds like Chicago. <laughs>